footfalls in ash. This is very nice Always change of scenery, though. To visit ash. We're in Waluda territory now. Don't expect a warm welcome. Oh, I don't know, Clive. That castle over there looks inviting enough. Shall we sample its inhabitants' hospitality? Oh. Remember what I said about warm welcomes, Gav. Oh no. True, I'm a hard seltzer. Yeah. <laughs> I can believe uh, you're hard, <laughs> but you know. Uh, this place is as dead as Grieger's ghost. Grieger's ghost. Wolfdar. So this is. So you're saying we should drink each other? Yes, friend. Do you have enough to provide for everyone? Just place yourself on the table so we can just drink. Drunk. Drink, drunk. Drink, friend. Yes. There is enough for everyone, I guess. Potion. Guess we'll be needing this. Oh. Okay. Well. Let's go here then. Fran's great flood. <laughs> Not the flood. Not the great flood. Franny flood. Floody Fran. Floody Lubidoo. <laughs> okay, so we need to. Cash sure. melt some of it. I see only orcs that are cashing. Let's hope the villagers made it out in time. Over here. Uh, you can't change icons during battle, but you can change your equipment. No, you couldn't. Oh, you couldn't? Oh, really? Yeah, I thought you changed it. Yeah, okay. Because I know the icons, but I thought you could do the, uh, the equipment. Could that, you? That thing is sick. Go on, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. That thing is actually sick. Yeah. Yeah, I, I kind of want to try without the timely dodge thingy. Mm. Uh... When you get to the first teleporter or the first fast travel, go back to the main camp then. Come and buy it. Time to fight. Orcish father. Very high up. <laughs> so let's get in there right away. Uh, why are they flying so high now? Uh, did he just do a beam? Yeah. Phoenix did a beam. This is no. very, yeah, very why, high. Why, up. why are you flying so high up? Did we go here? No. no. Uh, did we check here? No. No, wow. Uh, Like, is it because you equipped the... No, you didn't equip the... Did you equip the... Did you equip the jewelry now? No. Hi, Bjorn. Hi, Bjorn. Hello, I'm home. Welcome home. Oh, welcome home. And cheers. Mm. Oh, God. I would die with alcohol. You would die with alcohol? Without. Yes, that, that's, that's true. Without. But words are difficult, you know. <laughs> <gasps> okay. I like that. Huh? You will. She's in the casket. Amber. Heard. Amber, no, not the Amber Heard. Not the Amber Heard. I was just working my sp spray in your ankle? No. Oh, no. I'm sorry. Do you, do you need to go oh, to the doctor? Shit. Maybe need to stra strap it? Strap on? <laughs> What's it called? He strips it? Strap it? Oh, and during the summer as well. I hope you recover really fast though. Just 
problem having a bear in mind. Drink the pain away. I would also like for you to change out the diamond dust. Oh, you yeah, not like it? Mm, no, I, just, I want to see the other skill where you drag them towards you. Uh, yeah. Oh. Okay. Oh my god! Oh shit, yeah, now I'm really accustomed to... No, it's not okay, I just overdraw so I can go home early. <laughs> it's like, ah, oh, I'm so sick, I need to go. Fuck. Oh my god. That's also so fucking cool that mm. you can... Oh. <laughs> How would you guys have got have some... Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> it's been How a very chill day here. Very chill. Our brain is turned off. Uh, when I got home from work, I completely passed out on the couch for one and a half hours. I was really tired today, it's and it's so warm at work. Yeah. Can't Where handle it. Bullets. Seems you were right about that welcome after all, Clive. This bear doesn't handle heat that well. No, he doesn't. Mm. Reminds me of the first time I actually went to oh, yeah. Turkey, and it was like 48 degrees Celsius. It's not It's not normal. <laughs> Almost halfway to the boiling point for water. But it's not because you're there. Aww. Aww. Well, at least my bread is raising. Nah, man. It's called that. The bread is raisin. Yeah, have it. It's puns. Get with it. Get with it. Get with the program, John. Get with the program, John. Yes. Oh, the orcs. Oh, all oh, of them. So it's are... Lord of the Rings now. It's orcs and Akashi. Has the whole of Ash fallen into Ultima's hands? <laughs> no, my God, not the breed. Bread. It's bread. I mean, not what? the breeding bread. There's no peace delegation. We should send a warning to the others. <laughs> no. My uncle will have an eye on the coast. I trust he'll find a way to entertain any uninvited guests. Our mark is Drake's spine, and there's a lot of road between us and it. We press on to stone here. Hmm. Aye, you never know. It might not be an Esther Slavarin monsters. <laughs> <laughs> Slavarin. Clive. You must go on ahead without me. Oh? This stronghold is as old as Phoenix Gate. Perhaps older. It may yet hide Ultima's remaining secrets. And if we are to best him, they must be unearthed. All right. Stay out of trouble. I always do. Mostly. 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 Share about this. About leaving my brother on his own. Of course. Mostly. <laughs> <laughs> he always is. I mean, to be frank though, most of the chat is. This reminds me so much of Endwalker, it's insane. No, not Endwalker, Shadowbringers. Shadowbringers. Yeah. map is so old, it's hard to tell which way is up. <laughs> I always from do right, moistly. <laughs> moistly. Oh. Then we make our way there, resupply, and wait for Joshua. <laughs> I'm Shit. Yeah, Kinom. Oi. But it's very Norway. Yeah, this Oh very my much god, looks... is it Hardangervidda? There it is, I bought. We're just charming him, not ho not Honri. Honri, what the fuck is Honri? Who is Honri? Is that a leveled up version of Horny? <laughs> the angry gap. Speaking of, Ugh, this place reeks like a marble's arsehole. <laughs> Though I'm guessing it's not the smell that will kill us. Oh. 
van. Eh, vale, de hacer el al fondo, que era de los que Eso, bueno. Mira. No, we don't think Shane Keenan. We do not know what Gav means. Like, why are you not wearing tight swimsuit in the hot tub? I mean, hi, Borley. <laughs> hi, Borley. <laughs> I should never have posted that picture on the, that video on Instagram. Yeah. Or, or something. Uh, ah, yeah, nice. shit. And I just. Oi! It's worse though, but. Mm. Oi! Oi. Nice. Oh, that's so funny, though. It is. Uh, maybe you can level it up with something, though, when you go back to Blackthorn. Does it say it does anything? Uh, no. Not a custom cut in the cursed lot, choosing a close to the excess of the loading archipelago of seemingly come with the S. Uh, nice. Mm. I wish it was better, though. Mm. Hand the Hand of Rhea. Ooh. Should I try once? Yeah, before. Oh. Mm, I think in, if, uh, maybe you need to level up the Shiva. Because then the skills will be leveled up here. It's fine. Um, okay, so she has that one. And oh, that one, yeah. <laughs> Don't like rhyme. Curious if this is manageable though, because I feel like she was more crowd controlled than single target. Yeah, but uh, the, you need to be more aggressive. Instead of standing still and waiting for you to, you need to just give do more damage. If it is anything like the the, the bloody palace. I am trying. Yeah, I'm just saying. <laughs> That's that one. 
And this one, okay. What was the mesmerize? Yeah. Okay, that doesn't work. I... Some kind of a melee mage would be so funny fun with the fortune. I agree. I'm very curious about what they will add though in the next expansion, what kind of... Uh, um, as it called, what kind of uh, classes they will do. Uh, John and I talked about it the other day because it is uh, actually not that far away for the next expansion. Which I'm looking forward to. Well, it's not a healer. I'm calling mage and range. Yeah. I mean, it's not a healer, that's for sure, because they just added it. And also, they added the Reaper. And uh, before that, on uh, Shadowbringers, they added the tank and. Um, Dancer, was it? <laughs> they will add a necromancer. Yeah, just to piss on the like Diablo. <laughs> so many cool particle effects, my god. Tanks and dragoons so they control them. Very requested, like a beast master or beast team or something. Yeah. Like what it did with Summoner where they revamped it, it's so cool. Ah, fuck. It looks a pretty, pretty, pretty painful to be hit by that axe. Nice. Okay. Woo! Like a hundred from Octopath 2. Oh. Oh, yeah, that would be cool. Mm. Oh, I need to play Octopath 2. I haven't played it yet. I love that graphic so much. I love the graphics, but I still struggle with the same thing that I need every character to feel like they're on the journey with you. And I feel like that's the main complaint in the second one as well. Oh, diamond dust. I didn't see that. Holy shit, I did a lot of stagger. Oh my god. You took half the bar. Uh, yeah, 
yeah, same as the Octopath one. Oh, it was so good. And the music in Octopath is just one of the best uh, soundtracks I've ever listened to, ever. If it will be a tamer, would you like it with a pet you can change or something you tame out in open open world? Um, I mean, it would be cool if you could tame something out in the open world, if they will add it though, because it will be a lot of work for them. I don't know, but maybe you can choose between certain pets, maybe, and let they grow? Like a Pokemon. So you have like one of three starters, maybe. Okay, non, I completely agree. It actually triggers me a little bit. Not gonna lie. It, for me, if I'm gonna be completely honest, it will be like saying uh, that they say that Celine Dion is a bad singer. You can't say that Celine Dion is a bad singer. You can say that you don't like her type of music or her voice, but you can't say that she's a bad singer. And like with Masahiro Sokin, you can't say that he is a bad composer that, and that the music is bad because it's not. It is yeah. not bad. I uh, when I hear complaints about music in uh, in this game or uh, for that matter, <laughs> okay, I, I keep going back to Zelda, but I feel like it's very easy because Zelda is so mainstream heavily focused mm. it's the easiest game to get across the board and have mostly people like it the same kind of quests that people are fucking pre-coming their pants totally moisturized out of their asshole is in zelda is here mm. it's the fetch quests do they complain about them in zelda no but here it's like oh it's very this it's very that that's like the main focus i see on twitter mm. And then you can scroll a little back and they're like, oh my god, Zelda this, Zelda that. Oh god, fuck off. <laughs> I I just don't like it. I think it's very entitled. I feel like it's a very entitled thing that just because people are in this headspace that it's not my Final Fantasy. This this isn't a president election. It's not my president kind of... Ugh. I hate it. <laughs> I can't. I, I can't. Get with the program or get out. <laughs> it's the, where I am. It's like creator creators and game producers are not able to try and create new shit anymore because they just oh, want luck. the old thing. Uh, they're saying it isn't memorable and this is silly because music needs time to be memorable. Nostalgia plays a huge role in which is why when we listen to Aerith theme or like Hyrule theme, it's br it brings emotions and music evokes uh, emotions. If you don't like the story of Final Fantasy, the music won't give you the same emotion. Honestly, that was me when Scarlet and Violet came out. Yeah, I... With Scarlet and Violet for me, that's just... 
I think the game is unfinished. I think that's the only grape I have with that game. I feel like this whole debate with Fun Fantasy not being a Fun Fantasy also is just stupid. Mm. But the music really irks me. It's just... We can't be playing the same game. But as, oh, uh, but as fuck. you say, I feel like the same way. Uh, people tend to be entitled. Oh to my god! And they have so much. What to say? They, I think, they're just out to try to find something to complain about. Oh yeah. And that pisses me off because uh, then it will, in the end, it will turn out to be you will not find joy with anything. I feel. everything exactly always try to find something to complain about but uh, are they complaining about Tears of the Kingdom? No even I being a huge Zelda fan I think it runs poorly in so many places it is janky in so many places but just because it is Zelda it gets the free pass it's like a green card yeah and that is also very annoying and today's world be like that uh, and I fucking hate it it's like Come on. It is. It will be like Horizon Zero Dawn, such a fantastic game, completely forgotten because it was released on the same time as other magnificent st uh, games, but it's still not bad. Uh, that log was not Mura. <laughs> I will fucking slap you. <laughs> and work today, my men was very warm, uh, but I got to produce a lot of stuff at work. Uh, we made some dinners and great cakes. So it was nice, uh, but I was very tired when I got home, so I just passed out on the couch. That's the thing though. For me, like, I was playing Bayonetta 3 and I read so many fucking horrible comebacks, not comebacks, but commentaries on that game. That it runs badly. Yeah, it that was also stupid. It is unplayable. The graphics sucks. She doesn't look like the same person anymore. Blah blah. So many stuff. And it's like, give the oi diamond dust. Uh, oi, oh, nice. That's nice. It is uh, like give the creators who actually create the game some freedom. It is their game. They can do what they want with it. One thing is the fans. That's for sure. Uh, I don't enjoy DMC and Benetta Kano games, and I love yeah. Bayo 3. Exactly. That's the thing, but just, people need to give games a chance. They're so very fast to just nitpick on stuff, it's and all try to find the negative things. Always. Try by eyes complete. Okay, the that's fun. Yeah. Nice. That's the first one we're completed, though. A new level of chronolith difficulty. The final trial is now available. Oi. Oh, nice. This That's game is fun. so better than so many new games and new TV shows. Can I get people of gaming community not going? Yeah, me neither. Yeah. I feel like gaming communities has grown so entitled. It's the same with... I haven't finished Forspoken yet. Uh, and it's not a perfect game by any means. But that game got so much... Uh, shit. Mm. <laughs> that game got so much shit when it came out. And everything was Don't taken out of context. Literally, all the clips on Twitter and uh, uh, different social media were batshit crazy about how everything was so poorly done in that game. And I, I just don't see it. I don't see it. The only reason I haven't been able to finish it is because there's been coming so many games. We also stream a lot, so it's very difficult to find games I'm able to finish. Uh, because what I also have a very big problem with is that let let people enjoy the games. Oh god, yeah. When people come in with commentaries like, oh, this game is so bad, I don't understand why I like this game, blah blah blah. Then why are you in that person's stream? And or... why are you even saying it? 
That's the thing. Please keep it to yourself. I think it's been, for example, oh, God, we, we haven't had many, but we had a little bit here oh, and yeah. there. But I think it's very, I think it's very clear that Kim and R uh, is really gushing over this game. It has downright been impossible to not hear if you've been in the stream. And then it's like, oh well, it's this, it's that. I'm just like, you're this and that. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of haters. <laughs> I feel like COVID made people more um, intolerable. Entitled. And entitled, and also just... <laughs> Co COVID... Their board fucking was insane for some people. <laughs> mm, yeah, Fun Fancy Fortnite something. I'm still thinking. Oh, oh my god. god, Infamous 2. I love Infamous so much. Mm. So many haters indeed. <gasps> they just need to masturbate more. Yes. Yeah, g fucking get off. Yeah. Or get, go away. <laughs> just go. Just go away and wank. Get it out. Get out of frustration. Yes. What do you think, Clive? I think this town is um then we're too late. Abandoned. Damn it. They're all turned. There's nothing we can do. I wouldn't say nothing. People from the other people. Yes. No quarter! Go in. My <laughs> 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 Jar of juice. <laughs> I'm not gonna say, but if I'm not mistaken, I know the uh, I know the backstory of her name, Kimon. <laughs> Instead of a lightning orb. Yeah, seems better. Mm. Because the rhyme is really good though. And come and come and come. Who is curing? Oh, he's standing over there. I don't think I will ever be able to go away <laughs> with the beam. I'm excited it... to see the ultimate for Odin, though. Oh yeah, that might be it. No, it will not. No, <laughs> it will not be a beam. You can find up. Uh, you can find up by subscribing to my OnlyFans. Oh, 
Really? Yeah. Shall is, we is it just called the jar? The jar. Have a chat about the, the can pants? of juice. The, the jar. Just jar. <laughs> Of course it bloody isn't. Suddenly, suddenly Keenan actually has like a James Bond uh, character. The Jar. 007. Bob. <laughs> so, what's, he, what's your name? Jar. The Jar. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> um, Link, Fran came into that. He's like an open book, that Fran. Jar. Juice jar. <laughs> Shaking mustard. Yeah, that's a very difficult move to be good with. The rhyme? Or the dodge? The rhyme. Something about seeing all the numbers, I have to say. Oh! It's over. <laughs> You already have the link. <laughs> um, link. 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 What about Zelda? Zelda's only fans. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Her only fans will be the silent princess. Gav. Gav! Don't tell me there's more of the bastards. Oh. Fuck. <sighs> no! Have you come to watch, Odin? <laughs> He's so menacing. Bound for stone here. Good. My master awaits you in the capital. No, I cannot allow you to attend him in your present state. And how are you going to stop us? Why, with this! Oh my god! What the fuck? Senbon Sakura. Yeah, Kageyoshi. <laughs> Kageyoshi. This is like a noble's phantasm in Fate Night Zero or something. His design is flawless. Mm. This is insane. If the vessel would see the path opened, it has but to ask. I shall see that my master's prize is made presentable. Oh my god. 
Uh, he is so up to the tight. Yeah. yeah, very composed. Yeah, he's very uh, composed. Would you mind telling me what the fuck just happened? Oh. Oh, you've got to be. How are we supposed to get through that? We seek an audience with the king. <laughs> Oof. If his majesty wants me to come and ask him. Then that is exactly what I'll do. <laughs> Poor Crows. Kentucky Fried Chicken. Ha -ka! Before <laughs> you go practicing your petition. We don't even know where the fucker went. <laughs> How about we cool our heads and think this through, eh? All right. Shit. Maybe there's something here we can use. This, the, this reeks of final stages of the game. I'm uh, just yeah. saying, <laughs> this, this is typically in RPGs the final stages of a game. Oh no, we're close up. Oh, we're all gonna die. <laughs> you know, <laughs> <laughs> and then teleport at the end before the boss. That would be so. We got them all. Typical. So did I. Hmm. Ooh. Oh, bloody. Uh, check if you can teleport. Yeah, you can. Okay. You can go back to your main uh, the hideaway, though, and buy that thing. The thing? Mm. We can. Oh, there's also side quests here. Oh, God. All the side quests. There's and always time. You know, Odin can wait. The king can wait. And also you have uh, <laughs> hunts. Or a hunt. Oh yeah, the most likely Chimera thing. Mm. Chimera? <laughs> Clive is like, you know what, fuck this shit, let's Clive. go home. Yeah, yeah, you know, this is too mm. stressful. I'm just gonna go back oh, to the hideaway man. and have a tea. Uh, magic spells, I'm at I think that's nice to try. Yeah, yeah, try it. You'll not find a better price than that. Yeah. Oh, okay, so you just, okay, whatever. But uh, you, have to, you have to check what you remove, though. Mm, no, and because also, we can just buy them. Sure. Why not? You sure? Why not? You sure? Why not? You sure? Why not? Why not? Oh my God. More reading? Yes. More reading. Oh, oh shit. Yeah. I have the Bible. Oh, shit. It is hard to believe Theo is gone. Every morning I wake, I expect him to be there in the stables. Watering the birds and readying the packs, yet he is not, and it is everything I can do not to fall to my knees and weep. Still, I know I have to move on, but that doesn't mean I have to forget. My brother and I built all we have here together, so as long as I still have the caravans, he will ever be with me, and I shall honor him in death by carrying on what he strove for in life. That is what I choose. This, Eloise. This side quest here also was beautiful. Eh? Yeah. Well done. It was Super so sad. good. Thanks again for helping get the dungeon order. Had you not rode gall gallantly to our rescue, I reckon poor Owain and them let would still uh, the and them lot would still be in stuck. Oh my God! One more time. Thanks again for helping get the dungeon order. Had you not rode gallantly to our rescue, I reckon poor Owain and them lot would still be stuck stealing Blightwater over a bonner. There is always room for improvement, though, so don't get your knickers in a knot should I come a knocking at your chamber door looking for more spheres and ash and whatnot. Mid. Mid. What oh. happened in Eastpool with the bearers and the guardians has been a long time coming, and I'm proud that I could only that could finally happen here uh, in Rosaria. The Duchy of Old may be no more, but Archduke Elwyn's dream still burns in the hearts of many, and it's through victories such as these that the fire will spread. This is only the beginning, Clive. But a fine beginning it is, Martha. Clive, there's but one crystal left needs cracking, and but one man who can do it. See that you don't miss. Otto. Otto, Otto. Otto is best dad. 
Daddy Otto. Here, here for Otto. Oh, I'm confused. <laughs> but did we unlock something else in this one? No. Oh, uh, yeah. In the stone, yeah. Areti stone. <sighs> is it these? Mm. Clive level is fixed. Gary is predetermined. Trials begin with only 80 seconds. Oh, wow. That's very cool. Shall I try it? Uh, no. No. You just did it. You fucking wanted that button time trialism. Oh, okay. Mm. So it's not new. Okay. No, no. It's just that you start with less seconds and you need to just be better. Okay. So you unlock it and then you can just try and get better at it. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. Cure. Cure. Another one. Yeah, we got one. But maybe there's more now. I'm gonna need some me time, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's oh, two. Pandemo Aye. Pandemonium? <gasps> Those few souls who were able to escape from ash before the skies changed tell of Pandemonium. The king of the orcs who led his fellow beastmen in revolt against Valuda rule. Though this rebellion was swiftly crushed by King Barnabas' armies, many of the orcs who now roam the twins, sitting their appetite for human flesh, bear his markings, suggesting that he still commands his forces today. Cool. So he's in the ash somewhere? The trip, the tricephalic terror. A caravan of traders uh, traversing so the Velcroid. Uh, S. Yeah. Told me of a colossal beast they had encountered on the journey. To hear them tell it, it had an aspect of a dragon, a lion, and a scorpion all at once. I contest that it might be naught but a mirage, a phantasm brought uh, about the desert heat. Uh, but the sweat which ran down the forehead was cold, and the fear in their eyes real. Yeah, these. this is the one in the desert somewhere. Okay. And the other one is uh, for the place you are you are now. Uh, on that Ash? Girl, that, that in the... Oh, well, that, oh. This is my valen girl. Mm. Infirmary. Please, your grace. Oh, sure. My lord Marquis. Yote, is anything the matter? You seem troubled. Hi, well, what? Is this a worthy Final Fantasy game? game? Yes. Yes. Absolutely. Yes. Yes. Perhaps you might. It's your brother. His condition continues to worsen, though he does his best to hide it. The lesion on his chest pains him more with each passing day. I had feared as much. There are certain elixirs which can ease the suffering of those afflicted by the curse, but... But? But his grace's case is severe. The drafts I have been able to prepare for him thus far have ceased to have any real effect. Oh, yeah. So I consulted with Talia and certain of my comrades among the Undying about the possibility of finding something stronger. And thankfully, a recipe was found. The only problem being that the critical ingredient is exceptionally hard to come by. Oh, and no. our supplies are almost exhausted. Unless we can secure more soon, your brother's anguish will likely become unbearable. I... My lord, I know that I have no right to make demands of you. But would you help? For Joshua's sake. Of course. For Joshua. Anything. Yote is sweet. so sweet. Thank I love her. Lord. Hello, Kim. So, nice to see you. Thank you. How are you doing? How are you doing? Do you like, do you like your new job? Herb by the name of Stonerwort. It grows only where the ether is densest. The vigor it stores in its stems helps to counteract the curse. We discovered a patch near the aqueduct in Rosaria. But alas, yet more ether has erupted from the earth there recently, leaving the whole area flooded. The search continues for a new source. One that we might reach without being turned. Hmm. So it's only that you can't reach it. The stone and water itself is unharmed by the flood. Well... Yes, but... Then I shall go in your stead. Oh, but, my lord... You've yet to find another source, correct? So for now, the aqueduct is our best hope. Besides, I'm a dominant. The ether can't hurt me. Well, if you're sure, my lord, 
Stonerwort is easily identified by its blood-red blooms. Search around the aqueduct, and you're sure to find some soon enough. I shall remain here and prepare the other ingredients. Ooh. Okay. Um, yeah, 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 and yeah. So, we should do the side quest first and then we yeah. can go for the hunts. Oh, fuck. I keep doing this. Ah! <laughs> Doesn't play like the other games. Um, but you have abilities, you have skill tree, uh, and you can mix and match the icons that you use. Uh, but it's very nice. You can try different kinds of builds. Uh, you can actually specify how Clive plays to your liking. If you want to try to be a mage, if you like to be up close and personal, if you want to go for a, like a block. Oi. Um, Oh, sorry. Oh. Oi! I thought they can't get a slow. They're cool. Oh no, they're all. Seven, one of my favorite Final Fantasy games, but also this is also one of my favorite Final Fantasy games. Ah, oh, rather have some fancy combos. Oh my oh. god! Hi, Chad. Ooh. How are you oh my doing, god. daddy? Daddy! Oh! Oh! Hi, Chad. Thank, Thank you, you so much. much. How are you doing, handsome? Everyone, please go and give Daddy Chad a follow. He is a wonderful, wonderful streamer. We love him so much. I am beating that. How are you doing? <laughs> Gay and Edgelord has great excitement. <laughs> I love it. It's not, uh, so happy it's Friday. Nice. Yes. Are you doing any, anything exciting this weekend? Do you guys have any plans? Careful, I was gonna finger take you trying to poke someone's eye out. <laughs> Hi, Shipwreck. Welcome in. How are you? Hi, Shipwreck. Welcome in. Hi. Yeah, I mean no likey. We still have that one which can stand and do damage with... If we use this to build it up. Mm, yeah, and also you use the lightning rod with the Bahamut one. Yeah. Mm. I, th I think this can be a cool combo. Yeah. And we then have Shiva's... All the colors. Yeah. All the colors. And then we have Shiva's dodge mechanic, which is very good. Fuck. Yeah, can I please just read on the Shiva's dodge mechanic if something else happens? Uh, can we use dodging coming attacks? Can we use uh, frostbite? Enemy struck by frostbite will become temporarily frozen. Precisely dodging enemy attack causes uh, permafrost. Permafrost duration is determined by the strength of the enemy attack dodged. Okay, so because if you I was... dodge a very uh, strong attack, it will last longer then. Yeah, because I was uh, th I was thinking it doesn't say uh, shatter deliver a mortal blow to a frozen enemy. Wait, how do you do that? Probably if his last uh, health or something. Maybe. 
Or maybe if you kill them uh, while they are uh, permafrost. That could be. So, Chad, uh, Brian, Here it is. Uh, our jacuzzi is up. As much as I can fly for fly. Come and make bear broth. Come and make bear broth. Let's make the brand happen. Yes. <laughs> All right. Fly to Norway. That should do it. Let's get these back to you, Teddy. Airy fairy's broth. A fairy broth? Airy fairy elixir. That is something we will definitely gonna be able to sell. <laughs> no? May I join? Of course. I mean, your name is the jar of juice. You're gonna be the jar. We need the uh, we need the spicy uh, Middle Eastern uh, the spices. We need spice. We need spice. <laughs> Lol. You can rashid all over the place for my. <laughs> He's a very cool character, though. I hope you pick him up. I I, uh, I am definitely buying Rashid because I want to try him mm. heavily. My vessel is ready. Shipwreck. Oh, my vessel. His shipwreck. Couldn't rest as Rashid. Will this be enough? <laughs> I love it. No, that is content. Ooh. Yes, my lord. Thank you. I'm sure it will serve us until we can find another source. I'm very glad to hear it. Oh. You and His Grace are very much alike, you know. You think only of how you might help others, and never of the danger to yourselves. No more than you have, minding my brother. You've risked a lot for him, and I thank you for it. I am honored that you should say so. But I beg you, my lord, do not give too much of yourself for the sake of others. We could not afford to lose you. I'll keep that in mind. We'll see. We'll see. <laughs> we'll see. We all see. Nice. Nice. Uh... Okay, so the hunts. Yeah, one was in the desert, and the other one was in the new place you've gone to, I okay. guess. So let's do Pandemonium first, then. Those who few souls who were able to escape from ash before the skies changed tell of Pandemonium. The king of the orcs who led his fellow beastmen in revolt against Valuda rule. Though his rebellion was swiftly crushed by King Barnabas' armies, many of the orcs now roam the twins. The twins? Okay, so if okay. you go into... Um, Isn't that where we just came from? I don't know. Well, if we go in and zoom in on the map, maybe we can see some hints to where it is. So the mode is either here eller there. Okay. Um. Fuck. Shall I check here? It said something about. Um, it said something about a very big, and a very very warm place. It's the desert, so it's warm. Warm. Uh, I think I, th I also want to just buy. Oh yeah. The... Do you have money for it though? I think we Oh I don't know. Sounds like something's happening in the square. It's in the big landmass desert. Okay. Landmass desert. Mm. I'm that lazy. <laughs> up yup. Up yup. <laughs> up yup. Why the hell? To take the oh my god! Oh, sorry. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I can't can afford <laughs> that. So Hi, Sayan. <laughs> Thank you for the raid. <laughs> ah. uh, it's been a while since I've also played horror games now, so now everything that's a little Welcome. Loud, <laughs> loud is killing me. Ah. <laughs> How are you doing, Say? And thank you so much for the raid. I'm sorry, I know. <laughs> the poor dog is gonna be turned into a wreck. <laughs> How are we doing? Great. Uh, it's warmer again today, but we're still enjoying Fun Fantasy. How are you? And how are you liking Diablo 4 so far? You're sure? I am very sure. Okay. There it is. Oh my god, look at that. It's a freak show. Save. It's a freak show. Are you looking at yourself? 
Wow, thank you. You're welcome. Oh, my turn? Yes. Uh -huh. Try not to die, Kimothy. But you changed everything for me now. Yeah, well, get with the program. Get with the program. You're such a cunt. Oh no, okay, my feelings. Ow. Yeah, save I I know, but we're closer. Gorgimera. Gorgimera. I oh, don't remember no. him actually. Oh, me neither. Oh my God, it's Tiostra. We're not gonna worry about this one. Stay close, Toro. Oi, oh, that's God. cool. That's so cool. I feel like that's a good combo, you know. John, you drank too much cumulative vine to have feelings. I know, you. Yes, we have a beam now, saying We've got the Kamehameha wave. Well, I do remember now, when I came, uh, come to your stream for the first time, at the end, Thomas said, I really need to touch myself. It's it's his brand. Oh my god. Keenan, he's doing the 14 moves. Delta attack. It's so cool. I know! <laughs> This is Final Fantasy XIV. Oh, you can do the thing again. What? Oh my god. Oi! Cool. Holy shit, that's so cool! Oi, 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 oi. I love that it has placements. It really makes me want to go back to Final Fantasy XIV again. So sick looking. Oh yeah. Hi, Bear Paw. Welcome back. Happy Friday. How are you doing today? Oh, uh, laundry. Uh, good luck, Mara. Yeah, that's very good, actually. Oh, shit. Say, and this is so sick. <laughs> I'm never removing that fucking skill. Much better now that I have seen a Hadouken. <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah. 
This music is so fucking sick. Mm -hmm. Me in Fortnite many times. Oh, when they had the beam. Oh my god, it was the only time I was really <laughs> heavily playing Fortnite. Oi, nice. Or we needed that. You have to make the last sword. Size. Cool. Can we do that now, though? No, I think we still need one more thing. Uh, and the last one was in Ash, was it? Yeah. Or the Orc King, I think that was. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Please. Please. Please, no. Uh, miss. <laughs> Whoa. Easy. Easy. We're not turned, all right? Was she pregnant? Mm. Pregadante? <laughs> Pregadante. My thanks, kind travelers. Forgive me for asking, but what went on here? Oh, she's pretty. It all started when the skies changed. The elders said it was the Ark. One by one, people went mad. Minds taken by ether. Till only I remained. By then, I was too far alone to run. And, and then the nights came. And I didn't know what to do. And this... Uh, okay is just a story something our grandparents told us when we misbehave about how the heavens would grow dark before the land took her last breath the end of the world you said the others went mad but where did they go They all left. Mm. Holy shit. To one east, to the tower, to Reverie, the elder, the healer, the blacksmith, my husband. You thinking he did this? Of course. Who else could it be? You were in Canva. You saw what he did to the people. Then what about her? How come her nut hasn't cracked? <laughs> the baby, perhaps? Could be protecting her from the ether. I can't think of any other explanation. You mean... It's a bearer? It won't matter what it is once Ultima's magic takes hold. Time's running out. Shit. This tower. That's where we'll find the king. <laughs> I'm still traumatized by the last planet lady. <laughs> oh, uh, the last Thomas? Ma Ma Maria. Oh. <laughs> 
<laughs> you haven't moved on. Ah. Uh, oh, it's the same as Phoenix Gate. Move. Which means that the end of these stairs should be. Joshua is so cool. Yeah, I really like Joshua. Mm. Oh, it's a uh, an undamaged one. Or the mural. Sora. It's complete. Ultima and his vessel, the free. Garuda, Ramu, Shiva, Titan, Bahamut, Odin. Even Leviathan the Lost is here. Where is the Phoenix? By the Founder. Oh my god. So that's what you want. Isn't it, Ultima? Oh. Oh god. If it the devourer. So well, that's how it's gonna be then. I'm not asking, Gav. I need you to stay with Edda. What? I must do this alone. If I don't return, you're to find Joshua and make for the Enterprise. Understood? <sighs> Aye. Don't you go dying on me. Sid's name suits your miserable mug better than mine. Huh. Don't oh. worry. I haven't finished with it yet. <laughs> I love Gav. Me too. I love the character relations in this game. I wish they called it the high wind instead of uh, enterprise. Yeah, I think a high wind would be nice as a little mm. throwback. If yeah. Barnabas is controlling the Akashic, then wherever he goes, they'll follow. And so will I. Shit. Oh my god. This view, yeah. Wait. Ambrosia, you flew over here? That's very nice of you, though. Shatter, there you go. So you just break them. This game looks so good, it does. Yeah, it really does. I'm still so. 
happy that it's the most, the best sold true next gen exclusive for PS5. I think that's very nice. Yeah. Uh, this music also, though. What do you mean? It's so unmemorable. There's something there. I can feel it. But now's not the time. Oh? Hello, that. Yeah, the auto charge is actually going nice. Just it triggers me so much I can change during the combos and stuff. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> Love it. The edge of infinity. I'm gonna give you infinity. Playing. Oh shit! He's new. That's such a good stagger move, it's actually insane. Hi! Yeah, I thought I was doing the lightning thing. Still quite a good damage, I would say. Cool. Uh, did you uh, watch slash read any strategy about the damage multiplier? No, no not except for that the y your skills will deal more damage when the percentage it's at 1.50 I believe when it's staggered yeah the more damage you do during stagger you build a multiplier and I think it's max for now is 1.50 so you're supposed to use like the more damaging moves at the end of the stagger yeah. bar yeah like the ultimate but now we just we fixed up uh, uh, the um, what's it called uh, the loadout that's why so I fuck up Adamantite gauntlets. Wait, what? Something for the counter, maybe? Increase my hope by family. Ah. Ooh, nice. If you want to, that's nice, though. But yeah, yeah. The tactic you taught me with the fire wisps and the lightning rod is the popular way to get the multiplier up. Then hit the enemy with your best big attack. Yeah. Mm. We changed the wisps, but we still have the lightning rod. Mm. And now we use the attack uh, Titan has when he punches a lot of times. And... This is very reminiscent of Endwalker. Yeah. This is it, boy. Yeah.
Oh, you mean the perfect sick and stuff? Yeah. If there's if there's nothing else though, you're talking about. I press the up on the D-pad every time just to continue my combos, which is super cool. Oh Holy shit. Are ready for this? Did anything else? Uh... No. Okay, keep going. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Kan du slå lyden på telefonen? Oh, it's the same kind of structure as um, under the Phoenix Gate. Close. Best boy. Okay. He is showing so many human emotions. Yeah. Oy. Yeah, I think Clive is a very well written character. I think he's amazing. The Last King. Ooh. The Tower. Yeah, Clive is really amazing. He really is. He has become one of my favorite uh, main characters. To be honest, not only in Final Fantasy but in games as a whole. you're really entering the last king's chamber uh the music here is so foreboding yeah it seems so far to be very building up to something grand what's john's favorite icon in the game this time it's ifrit i love ifrit i think ifrit is insanely amazing here and i think it's kind of funny because ifrit has always been kind of cool looking Usually one of the first you get, have a mind of their own. but also just as fast as you get him is often the one you get rid Jesus. of first. But this time he's like the most important one, and I, I think that's super cool. Um, so I, lo I love Ifrit here, I really do. But yeah, Leviathan, the Lost. So that's where the DLC will be. That's probably the DLC then. If it, if, if it will have DLC. If the game sells well. I am pretty sure they're going to make a DLC or a sequel or something like a prequel. It, it would be weird if they didn't, because that's usually how it is. And this game also was made in its own engine, I believe. I watched an interview with Yoshi P and he said he's listening to the fans but didn't confirm a DLC. Yeah, I, th I think we might have seen the same DLC. I think he talked about uh, something he would think would be cool is <laughs> to
to put Alexander into the game. Oh my god. And he would love to be having Alexander come out of Rosaria's castle or something, but it wouldn't fit with the coherent story somewhat. Uh, and his translator wants Torgal to be play playable. <laughs> Yeah, it very much seems like uh, a Godzilla hero character here, and I love it so much. Um, and one of my favorite characters so far in the game, that's actually Benedicta. I love how broken she was, and how full of rage she was for very good reasons. Benedicta is unhinged, but it's very much implied that she was raped from an early stage in life, and so the only way she got control was to play with people with sex. And when she doesn't get her will, she loses it. Basically. It's so fucking dark, it's insane. I can't believe that this is a Final Fantasy game, to be honest. I love it so much. Oh, I came from there. Okay. I zoned out for a sec. What the fuck are we talking about? Uh, we're talking about favorite icons and characters and such in the game. Um, and one of my favorite characters in the game so far is Benedicta, because I loved how broken she is. And how very much it didn't shy away from the fact that oh this game will show it in your face and it will imply its shit really heavily for you there are two uh, late side quests which are really heavy and should come with a trigger warning oh really I can't wait to play them me neither I mean, this game starts... Uh, if you get through the beginning of this game, you should already kind of know what you're in for. <laughs> oh, okay. But yeah, Benedicta, I, I think about her character daily. I think she was amazing. And her rage is very justified, I feel. Why she was the way she was. And it becomes kind of this, you know, sympathy for the devil card. I think that's... When they do that, I love that shit. It's the same with... Uh, it's not exactly the same, but one of my favorite villains in Final Fantasy lore is Emmet Selk. And Arden from Final Fantasy 15. Emmet from 14 and Arden from 15. They are so good characters. Oh, sleep tight, Borley. Sleep by Borley, Mer. Yeah, both of them are amazing. I love them, Kinon. And I, I feel like. like both of the characters are so, yes, they're the villains, but can you say you don't understand why they did what they did? I, I personally would, you know. I ju I'm just saying. <laughs> yeah, Dark Team Games is, I, I like some good, uh, uh, you know, 
brighter games also, but what really hits home with me is darker themed games. I have always uh, catered more towards that. The darker, the better. Um, and I love it. For example here, the violence here and the blood and the gore isn't... Where would I be? The top. So I could look down on the world. Oh. Makes sense. It's not too much. It's not there to be, you know, gory. It's there to tell a story. I had this conversation with Thomas because I don't in general enjoy gore porn. Unless it's for a fun factor. For example, Mortal Kombat is gore porn. But it's made with humor in mind. It's not made to be taken seriously. But I feel like all the violence and all the terrible shit happening here, it tells a story. And this story wouldn't be able to tell without that kind of gritty and uh, dark tones. And I, I fucking love that shit. It also m makes those sweet moments, for example, with Clive and Jill on the beach. It makes them so much uh, more important. Because, oh, they're fucking time to rest. This is their their first breeder in years. Yeah, it was so beautiful. I love the Torgo. Clive used to play. It's super effective. Yeah. <laughs> the combos in this game it's so cool oh, la. wait wrong button yeah you kind of breed with them that's true and the, the beach scene it's wonderful and it's sexy <laughs> it's so fucking sexy The way he's looking around and checking the surroundings and stuff. Yeah. It's so many details in this game, I love it. Oh. Oh, it's one of those guys. Hello. Oh, oh. Yes, you have a beam. Good for you. Thank you. Boss? Oh no, it's uh, That's new. basically an elite enemy. Oh. Wasn't that guy in God of War? <laughs> Shit. I hope that if they have a male main character in the next game that he is chunky. <laughs> I mean, I, it, I would say that Clive is not chunky, but he's definitely on the beefier end. He definitely, he ate, you know? He had this meat. <laughs> but it's more athletic kind of beef. But I would love... Uh, a chunky 
chunky main character. Watch it. Oh, sleep tight, Mara. I hope you have a wonderful night and happy weekend. Nice. Clive is like Geralt. I like that. He really is. He really seems like a, a Geralt. Although I feel like their characters mm. has similarities, but personality-wise, they're also different in just enough anymore. aspects. I feel. Yeah. Sleep well, Mara. Sleep well. And also, Geralt, to a certain degree, you can kind of structure his personality a little bit according to your own, how you would answer certain things and such. But in general, you can say that Geralt's character is... I, I don't know how he is in the books, but in the show, for example, I feel like they have a lot of similarities. But Clive is a big softy. He's a really big softy. The fact that they're lifted up with the with the uh, with the magic makes it so much cooler. Yeah. Because then you can do the phoenix shift to fly up into them. Oh, that's so cool. The will of the ice. And Bugs is kind of in the middle sometimes. He's very kind of hero, like he always want to be something. Uh, be sometimes he's just a witcher. Yeah. I kind of want to uh, read the Witcher books. Might have Audible or something. I guess. Ugh. I can feel the suspense on this. I am, I am stressed as hell now. We're so high up. This is also quite funny. I watched Asmongold's video earlier today about Blue Protocol. And they're talking about what is it with the games from Asia and Towers. Mm. <laughs> and, hey, <laughs> you know. <laughs> There's always Towers. Oh my god. Osma! Oh, that would be cool. It's definitely bigger though. It's a, it's a reference though. Oh, it's cool. oh, yeah. Okay. This is the boss, I guess. Yeah. Control no. No, do. Oh. <laughs> Torgal fetched the ball. <gasps> yeah, I like the slow time when you dodge. But I do feel like when you use it, it gives you a lot of time to breathe. So it's nice to try without and get more flow of the combat. Oh, 
Oh! It would have been so sick if we could freeze uh, him in the lightning. I am. Uh oh. Oh my god, kid. Cycling through all the icons. <laughs> and then new rumors also about the Final Fantasy Nine remake is that it will have the same kind of production value that uh, the Crisis Core reunion had. Really? So that means it will probably be completely faithful to its turn-based roots. Cool. But the graphics will be basically next gen. That's fucking because fantastic. Crisis Core is very true to its PSP game. They just revamped the combat a lot. But that game already had action. Atlas, but I killed you! Return. Oh, vagina face. Not the vagina. What one more, eh, Togo? Okay. Ooh, girl. Okay. Wow, I cannot dodge today. Oh, okay. Oh! Vagina face. Vagina face. <laughs> Cloudburn thief could have made us use this into the lift going on. Oh, I loved that they actually put that into the game. And I remember I saw Max's face, the Maximilian dude. Uh, when he got that part where they were walking up the flight of stairs, <laughs> he was crying and laughing. Oh, it's so nice. Wait. It was so funny. They took something that was already very good and just made it even better. Uh-oh. 
Oh my god. Oh my god. He's very aggressive. Oh, yeah. At least the beam is good. <laughs> nice. Vagina face is dead. Goodbye. Not the face. vagina. Vagina. Oh uh, yeah. What you said to freak boy? Shall I continue? Yeah. The Biden? <laughs> yeah, the beam actually has quite low uh, cooldown as well, mm -hmm. I feel. This tower is fucked up, though. Almost there. Poor Clive, he must be so tired. I mean, lived as a slave for 13 years or something, then finding out you killed your brother, not to find out you didn't kill your brother, but your mentor died that you had gotten a brother relationship with, and then, you know, take his name, <laughs> free slaves. Yeah, I would, I would say he's probably quite tired. <laughs> so, Clive, on a vacation? Yes. A wait KK maybe? Oh, and not, uh, let's not forget uh, forget his probably early extremely fun years with his mother. Oh yeah. Which very lovable mom. Blatantly said she didn't love him. I see. Yeah. Uh, you know. He's here. I very love him. I can feel him. Clown and John Hotton. Oh, uh, oh yeah. my god. Please. Wouldn't have said no. Both but Clive and the voice. Have you seen his voice actor? Yeah, he's very hot. I am screaming. But I mean, can we please get Hubo Kupka though? I mean, we couldn't join him in the hot tub because it would actually take the whole tub. The whole tub. The whole tub. Okay. But we could sit and watch him. He has a statue of Ultima. Damn. It's so fucking freaky. Okay. Oh lord. Mr. Mommy Issues Man, where are you? Akashic? Why? The blade must ever feed if her edge is to remain keen. What care you for these worthless creatures? They are nothing. Weak from the moment of their conception, ever longing for power not theirs to command, they turn unfailingly upon themselves. Like sheep, they roam in filthy flocks, eager to trample those few gifted a fleece of gold. Or that they might feel contentment with their pitiful existence. Prejudice and persecution, severance and strife, every earthly wrong springs from the malice in men's hearts. Malice born of the pain and suffering that is free will. 
Its corruption is gnawed at your being from the very moment of your birth. You're wrong. It is no corruption. It is who I am. Every choice I make, right or wrong, gives me reason to carry on. And carry on I shall. Not as a puppet, but as a man. Which are you? <laughs> there was a time I too thought those the only choices. What? Long ago, God granted man the gift of magic. And with that gift did he build great civilizations. Yet over time, man lost sight of the gift's true meaning. Stepping from the path of shared prosperity to one of avarice. He abandoned his creator for sword and flame, and through his folly, beckoned the blight. Yet, there were those few who refused to turn their eyes from the heavens. And they prayed to God that he might lead them back to righteousness. And the Lord, he did answer. Before the worthy shall the gates of paradise open, and so did I spread my arms to the ether, and cast my soul upon its gentle waters. I gave myself unto him. Proven, the Lord charged me thus. If your kind are to find salvation, they must be made to serve. You see, paradise lies but a single step away. Could we only take it? Could we only leave our transgressions behind? For none save the pure of heart and mind may set foot in the new world. I will save us. But it all begins and ends with you. You are the key, Mythos. And with this humble offering, shall I prove my faith once more. So you forsook your kingdom. You forsook yourself to serve. Tell me, how is that living? <laughs> What you seek to provide is not salvation. It's anything but. Life is about always having a choice. Take that away, and we might as well be dead. Oh, 
Oh shit! Desperate, are we? <laughs> oh my god! Okay, so they're changing. Oh my god, what's happening? <laughs> oh. Enough, Nikos! 
โอ้โหาดิกุดเ
Oh shit. He did fucking something to that's amazing. Could it be you have made a weapon of your weakness? <laughs> My apologies. You are not the fool I took you for. Oh, he's losing it. I had thought the tantalizing kiss of self indulgence a dream by a <laughs> Why does he sound like the elf in Lord of the Rings? You <laughs> shall have a queen! Oh yeah! Han blir bare kulere og kulere da.
very well placed, not gonna lie. Barnabas needs to, needs to be a trial. He, oh, how big you need to keep on, yeah. Imagine that, though. That you will never know in this flower. Oh, <laughs> what the fuck is happening? Oh my, oh my god. god, this is, 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 is Susano. Yeah, I was gonna say Susano, yeah. Oh! 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 <laughs> it's literally a trial. right now <laughs> uh, uh, what's it uh, <laughs> that was the silver fang attack you know when he's just uh, oh, yeah. batoga <laughs> Yeah, this is this is great. I love this so much. I can't wait to play this on a hard mode. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> well, you know, your bottom is gone. Tries. Yeah, actually, this Final Fantasy game has convinced me. I would love uh, 17 to have something similar, that mechanic wise, but then with more characters. I think that I, I am sold. I love this so much. elemental properties of the attack that would be really great that's one thing I have missed actually but it's almost like you know since fire damages fire here I think it's been more focused on the core aspect of everything being power Nice. I fucking love Shiva. I think that would be great. I would like loadouts 
which I still have hope for they might add in a future patch here. Because there's so many builds you can have and I love it. I love it so much. Uh, and it's kind of sick to think about that we're getting Final Fantasy VII Part Two within six months or so oh, yeah. after this. That's insane to me. Oh! <laughs> nice. Stand victorious. My will that prevailed. Your will? No. It was his. Clive Rossfield. Cutscenes are fucking amazing. Uh, oh, Kai, that was fucking amazing. Oh. Dark Shard. Oh. I guess we're getting older now. <laughs> oh, fuck. Perhaps there is strength in will. Would that I had not relinquished my own. <laughs> you relinquished nothing. What was it, if not will that made you strive for a new world? Strive to win your master's approval? shown a fantasy and you chose to believe it but you were wrong there is no world but the one we live in and that world that world is worth saving even if it means killing a god Shall 
fulfill our destinies. Just as the Lord's Mother Crystals have fulfilled theirs. Come, Clive Rossfield. Take what is rightfully yours. Become one with God. No. The same happened to I'm him that happened home. to Kupka. Oh, yeah. Mother. Oh, shit. Okay. No flashback? Tell me, how does it feel? Show yourself! Face me! How does it feel to consume your rival's strength? To gorge yourself on their being? To edge step by trembling step, ever closer to the divine? With or without a will, you are still but a vessel, our vessel. Behold, how your body shudders in anticipation of its fate. Oh, it's not yours yet. No. Come then, O oh wayward child. We shall await you upon the back of the first worm. There, all shall end and begin again. Full raspberry. <laughs> oh, there we go. Oh no, oh god, no, 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 no. That was the uh, in the beginning. When there was a fight to be had, since they stripped me of my rank and banished me from the battlefield. Now I'm stuck fighting the backside of this one while the city burns and my wife fails over the man half my age. And then you turn up. What the hell are you doing here anyway? What indeed? <laughs> The enemy numbers 200,000 or more counting the orcs. There are simply not enough soldiers garrisoned in the capital to repel an army of that size. The 
then one of the central keep. Held by a contingent of soldiers and bearers from the surrounding forest. They are the sole reason it still stands. And all it took was an army on their doorstep to bring them together. The prospect of death does put things into perspective. <laughs> yeah, perspective. Perhaps it's what we've lacked all along. Oh my god. Numbers are few, but I shall rally as many of my dragoons as I'm able. You, apprise the Lord Strategist of the state of the city's defenses. Yes, your radiance. And you would fight alongside us. I owe the Phoenix a debt. <laughs> Does this vouch for my nephews? Aye. But I still have my doubts about you. Which we can discuss later. Indeed. You said you had men garrisoned in the keep. Captain, do you know how many yet remain? Allow me to confirm. Commander? Whatever their number, Randalar will be needing Gather the them bodies all. and build a pyre in the courtyard. Quickly. Terence. My lord. I'm so happy Terence lives. You will find a girl there. A girl? We the are in the middle girl? of a war. I owe her my life. And I always pay my debts. <laughs> you are to see that she is provided for. Dion, I cannot leave. But you shall. If I am ever to be worthy of the forgiveness of our people. Then I must earn it. And I must earn it by my hand. And my hand alone. Know that I do not ask this lightly. <laughs> and know that I will do it. Farewell, Terence. Aishla.
Clive, thank fuck. You all right? I am. But I'm a damn sight better for seeing you, Joshua. Than Barnabas. The king is dead. This game is so sad, oh my god. They are, but so is their killer. He can't hurt anyone anymore. You safe. I'm sorry, Clive. You know I want nothing more than to go with you. I do. But I'm glad you're heading back to the Enterprise nonetheless. And not just for Edda's sake. Our people need to know what happened here. You can count on me. As can she, I hope. Thank you, me lords. Do you think that was wise? Wiser than leaving a woman with child alone in the Deadlands. They'll be safer at the hideaway. For now, at least. This land is overrun with Akashic. The king himself was long turned, albeit by choice. All to serve Ultima in his damnable quest to forge the perfect vessel. The chaos Barnabas wreaked upon nation after nation. How many were killed for this? Ah. Uh, he didn't consider it killing. Or a mercy of sorts. A way to end their suffering. He truly wanted to save mankind, and ultimately use that. As he uses us. But why us? What are we? What are we? We are dominance. That is our fate. But that doesn't mean we have to accept it, which is why we fight. For the right to deny it. Is that not so? It is. For our sins. Barnabas said something else. That the Mother Crystals were Ultimas. Ultimas? Are you certain? We know that the Mother Crystals have been leading the land of Ether, And we also know that it's this which hastens the spread of the blight. But what I cannot fathom is what Ultima stands to gain from that. What did you find in the stronghold? The truth about Ultima's prize. For so long, 
I believed it to be you, and you alone. Yet, it is not merely a freed that he desires, but a freed and phoenix both, that which we became in the skies over Twinside. Only when the twin flames are joined, shall his vessel be complete. Quite why he needs a vessel is another question. Unless... There is something he cannot achieve without one. Something his immaterial form precludes. Something requiring an unthinkable amount of ether and a body resilient enough to channel it. If I did not know better, brother, I would think that he meant to cast a spell. A spell a thousand years in the making. A spell to end all spells. And he cannot do it without us, nor without the Mother Crystals. But if we destroy them all, we will stop not only the Blight, but Ultima as well. We stick to the plan then, only this time, we face him together. Well, it's a long walk to stone here. Let's not keep Ultima waiting. <sighs> Why, Brotherhood? But I have to leave. Tuning. Oh my god, it's so cool. Such a gun, gun uh, fanatic yeah. flurry of attacks that damages all enemies within range. Oh shit. Something so can... Nice. That's pretty sick. When Barnabas fell, his okay, magic died with him. The road to stone here is barred to us no longer. 